Hello, this is Victor. I'm here with a new um, review or unboxing of a codex. So this is going to be the codex of the orcs. I know that uh, have been in the market for. Uh, oh, I'm not the first one reviewing that, but I just wanted to share with you as I'm doing this for all the codexes. So I want to keep doing that. So here we have this is the codex of the orcs. Uh, just uh, I get it today. So uh, it's this uh, typical format of a codex with um, we have this artwork here uh, at the at the back covers and it's about 137 pages. Okay, 136, 136 pages. Not small, not the biggest, but um, it's not the smallest. So let's make a look what we have inside. So you can see we have Ben nice artwork. Uh, we have all as well as we can see in all the codexes. They, they are themed, so the artwork around the codex is themed depending on the faction that you're playing. We have this normal structure of the codex where we have the fluff at the beginning, we have then the, the showcase, and then we have the rules of uh, first the rules of the units and then the rules of the army. Uh, again, here we have a very nice artwork. They are fighting against this flying um, guy. I'm curious to know who is this guy with an axe. Maybe it's, I guess it's from the Blood Angels, uh, but it looks quite uh, uh, like an angel of vengeance. So here we have um, the the background uh, of the of the goblins, I have the goblins of the orcs, and the Gretchings, of course, and some of the yeah they, they talk about the Gretchings culture and the gods. And, and the nature of the beast, so we have here all the, and we have the tribes, and we have uh, talk about the evil sons, blood eggs, goths, um, death schools, blood, bad moons, a snake bite clan, and the freebooters. This is also quite interesting, the glyphs of the orcs. So, yeah, we have, and then with the god of the, what is the wah, we have the segmentum with all the places where we have orcs, and it looks quite green to be fair. So there are orcs almost everywhere, okay? The typical chronology, okay? And then, and again, another nice piece of artwork. I think it's this one. Yeah, it's the same piece of artwork we have here. We have it here in color. Uh, they are fighting against the Tau in this artwork, so now it's interesting to see that it's not only against Imperial. And we start with the in, in explanation of each unit, starting with the War Wars, the North and Mega Norths. And you can see we will have different. I will go fast here. Uh, um, and we should not share all the book. I just want to give you a peak view of what you can find here. Then we have, of course, this is new artwork for sure because these vehicles were not existing before. Here we have also the um, artwork of the new vehicles. So uh, quite interesting this. Okay, so just look at the new vehicles. But then we have. You can see we have all the different, and then they put uh, it's interesting that they put artwork everywhere. And then and then here we have the Stone Boys and the bot that's good. And I guess we are going to have here the different the commandos and the boss. It's, it's, it's called this Snickovat Captain Badbook. Then, of course, we cannot, we cannot miss uh, Gathkulf Tobacco. Okay. And the showcase is always interesting. Interesting that who is painting here? Uh, Gathhul Tvaka. Okay. He went for more orange looking on these teeth and all these type of things. Quite curious that thing. So we have here the big Gathhul Tvaka in the middle. We have, of course, artwork of the new vehicles, but we also have some of the uh, previous miniatures as well. So we have here the Gorkanaut. Uh, all the team engines, we have here the Captain Badbook. I guess now it's fine cast, I'm not wrong. We have the new vehicles painted here. Okay. And then yeah, after that we go to the rules. So here we have the generic rules for the orcs. Remember the rules they have is Daka Daka Daka. Uh, each time you roll a uh, hit, roll of, of six, uh, mo modify six for an attack with a ranged weapon made by a model of this unit that hit succeeds regardless of any modifiers. In addition, immediately 
additional hit roll uh, against the same. So you you it's sixes are going to explode here in the shooting. We have the here we go, so you can roll charge rolls for this unit when uh, doing so. You can roll all uh, or any dice, so you can roll all, roll one. We have the mob roll that is also. The leadership characteristic of this unit, uh, you can use either its own leadership characteristic or can choose uh, for the characteristic to be equal to either the number of models in the unit or the number of models of another friendly unit at 6 inches, what is super interesting, now it's, this is becoming more strong, it's going to be quite difficult to break the orcs. And then we have the speed mob, the speed mob is the first time this unit uh, is set up. On the battlefield, all its models must be placed within six inches at least of one uh, one other model from the unit, and from the point onwards, each model uh, operates independently. So it's, I guess it's for the vehicles. Uh, we have here the war gear list. Then we start having, you know, we'll start with uh, Gathcol Tracker, War Boss, Big Mac. Then we have Big Mac with shock attack gun and Big Mac with mega armor and the wheel boy and the boss is Nick Bot and the boss that's good that's took and Death Killer War War Strike and Captain Badbook Boys Vetching Matt uh, Matt Doc Gox Goxkin Goxnik sorry so these names are not Matt Doc Goxnik and this is Elite. So and troops is just boys and glitchings. The pink boy, Mac, uh, Ran, Herd, the Barna boys, Tank Busters, Knobs, Knob, Mega Knobs, Knobs on war bikes and commandos. So interesting that they still have the knobs on war bikes. Uh, war bikers that we go now to the fast attack. Yeah, war bikers and fast attack, custom Bosta blasters, and the shock jam. I'm looking for the new the numbers of the news. So yeah, I guess these are some of the new vehicles. The boom daka now is nas wagon. So and the mega truck scrap jets, the ruka truck is quick boogies, then the stop was and the death copters and the mech guns. So this is heavy mech gun, battle wagon, can wagon. So I'm just looking the name of new vehicles are the ones that I read. I don't want to be mistaken. I'm not that familiar with the orcs. It's not an army that I'm playing. But I just want to see the name of the vehicles. It's it's always fun uh, to see the name of they put on the vehicles. Yeah, we have the the this is the mega truck scrap jet. Is the one that have like a turbine and then we have the boom daka is not wagon is this thing this is the raka track is quick buggies is the one that is like a, a track yeah then we have the custom boosters blasters and the shot jump drachtas that are the boogie likes custom boostum blasters so just let me check. This is the custom booster blasters are these guys here. So these are eight wounds and it's a like a vehicle and they have they have they have the here we go, the, they, they have the speed mop, and then we have another the shock jam dark stars also have the speed mop. All of them have it, yeah, all of them have the speed mop. Even the Ruka track is quick movies. So yeah, we have here all the all the different units. We have the killer cannon, the, so the the more canout, the gore canout, the lutas, all these are heavy. The flash gith, the tracks that are mm, transport, and then we have the flyers, the Daka Jet, the Barna Bomber, the Blitza Bomber, Bomber. The was boom blast digest and then we have as Lord War the Stomper. Okay. We have also terrain that is the Mech Boy Workshop. 
get this new, is a new piece of the right I put there or there. Really, if I ever do also, I think I will focus on the vehicles. I really love this type of vehicles. If I ever do more stream, but that should be. But uh, here we have this. I always like this uh, overviews. But I'm planning maybe to buy the Speed Freaks later on. Uh, but yeah. And then we have all uh, the armies. If you use a Battle Forge um, with uh, on where all are orcs, then you have some additional rules here as we have in all the armies and we have the clan cults so like uh, cultures similar to the uh, yeah, to the chapters or anything that we have in other type of armies so we have the golf bad moon evil sons death calls snake bait uh, snake bites uh, uh, blood axes and the freebooters we have stratagems some generic some dedicated to the Clans like this one, for example, is a bad moon stratagem, or this one, these are the ones from the clans. Then we have the warlord traits, as we have for any other armor. We have the relics that is called shiny gobins. Uh, warlord traits, so uh, I mistake, these are the power of these are the warlord traits, this is the psychic powers, and then we have the warlord traits, and we have the specific warlord trait for each clan. And we have, of course, the points of everything to be able to play. So here we have all what we need and they will have their own tactical objective. I will not have the cards because I'm not interested in that at this moment. But yeah, this is another, if you want to play Orcs, you have to have this, of course. And yeah, and this is uh, the codex. So Orcs, are the own, they have their own codex, no more index for them. And I think it's looking quite nice and yeah looks quite good so yeah that's all the review I want to share here so you can see what is in the book in case you're interested or you want to know what it's coming in okay that's all for now uh, I hope you have liked this video let me know what do you think and as usual thanks a lot for watching and see you again later bye